Nistios, you're back! And not a moment too soon. I got what you asked for. Who is this of Xesia? This is the Mistios who's going to reignite our spark, my love. Oh, no! We've been through this. I can't satisfy you anymore. You're going to kill me with your lust. Nonsense! I'm going to make you an elixir that will give you the vigor of a man a fraction of your age. God save me! I cannot do this anymore. Your husband is tired. Allow me to satisfy your hunger. I've never been with a mercenary before. Very well, let's see what you're made of. Did she... have fun? That should hold her, for a few days at least. Thank you, Mistyus. Here, take this as payment. You've more than earned it. Malaka! If it isn't the eagle bearer herself! You got big since Kefalonia! And you got old, Photios, the dog's breath. Last time I saw you, I think I lit your ship on fire. <laughs> my ship and my beard! These days, thankfully, I've semi-retired. Do people pay mercenaries here more than they did in Kefalonia? <laughs> of course they do! Better than Marcos, that's for sure. Everyone pays more than Marcos. You're lucky I took all his crazy contracts. <laughs> I was a false learner. He's a rotten cheat. I only accept the easy stuff now. I'm working as a watchman this very moment. The cushy job. Most days. I could use a break myself. <sighs> Some break this is. Today feels just like old times. The job got harder than anticipated. Did something happen? <sighs> a couple of priests ransacked this treasury. They took the Zaphires offered by a Thracian king. The bastards. <laughs> Your employer won't like that. No, but you like this. Make an example of the thieves. You find them and the Zaphires, and I'll pay you much better than you're used to in Kefalonia. 
So these sapphires are really valuable, right? <laughs> you spawn of a salty slime worm. You have them already, don't you? Hand them over. And don't you dare tell me I can't pay you. Great to see you again, Photios. Savor your retirement. And you savor your youth. Don't become a washed-up sea dog like me. What's your problem? What don't I have fucking problems with? The Oracle for one, the sea for another, and don't get me started on my crew. You have business with the Oracle. You're a long way from Delphi. Had business. And my business is none of your fucking business. I ain't shopping for a merc. If anything, I need the gods. You need a god? I'm the next best thing. Oh, you're a live one. That's a good pitch. I'll give you that. So who are you? Captain Yellon of the Shark's Tooth. Shark Tooth's your boat? Do I look like a fucking fisherman? I sail a ship, not a boat. Malaka, I came to see if you needed help. Fuck you. No one asked you to. You know what? Fuck you. <sighs> okay, sorry. Been a bad day. I finished my business with the Oracle and was meant to meet my ship here. They're nowhere to be fucking found, and I've been here since last night. So where is the shark's tooth? I wouldn't fucking be here if I knew, would I? Okay, let me rephrase. Where was the crew meant to be? Well, um... I sent my girl Yiki off. Pilgrims get stuck in the shallows round here, and uh, we sort of help out. Oh, your girl? Yeah, best hand I ever had, and more. Look, find my ship and my Yiki, will you? I'll pay. I'll find out what happened, and bring them back. I'll find them and return as soon as I can.
ότι αυτοί είναι τους νέους και ούτε καταμαλθαγίζονται. Έλα. Σύνελθε, σύνελθε. Move. Let's go. Thermopylae, they say you can't walk this battlefield without getting blood on your toes. If you close your eyes, you can hear them. Their final war cries, before every last one of those brave Spartans perished. Their voices were silenced that day, but their story will be sung for an eternity. You didn't bring me here to talk about dead Spartans. What's on your mind, Herodotus? The Battle of Thermopylae still echoes in our hearts. But to stand here is to feel it in your bones. There's nothing here but ghosts. My concerns are with the living. Hold out your spear. My spear? What for? I need to know something.
Hirodotos. Uh. I'm fine. I'm fine. The stories are true. That is the spear of Leonidas. The hero's blade. You knew this would happen. I didn't know, but I did suspect. There is a place I'd convinced myself was a dream. Until now. A peculiar structure on the island of Andros. Mysterious shapes carved in stone. Like nothing I've ever seen. You want to sail to Andros so you can show me shapes? In my travels, I heard whispers of an ancient civilization. A people who came before. Your spear and that place are connected. The spear awakened to you, Herodotus. I trust you. You understand. I will do everything in my power to help you find your mother. I promise. But first, we must sail to the island of Andros. I'll meet you at my ship. Welcome aboard the Adrestia, Irodotos. Will you be traveling with us? Only for a short trip. I have business to attend to in Athens. Irodotos is helping me find my mother. Seeking help from the gods has put Irodotos on your path, just like they put you on my... in ways beyond our comprehension. And all we can do is follow their lead. You could be right. The other does not I shall understand. I can be not. He is... was... part of a very powerful group called the Cult of Cosmos that controls the Greek world through the Oracle. Control the Oracle? Impossible! Apollo would not allow that! Now they're looking for my mother. I need to find her. Before they do. And I believe they will call the battles before the most of you are on the way. Fire, Hermes! The Oracle lost to corruption, and now this cult? Do we know who leads them? I don't know for sure, but I think it might be my brother. Your brother? Why, Zeus, your life is complicated! Tell me, brother. But don't you worry. This cult of Cosmos now has three new enemies. And one of them fights like Athena, and shit thunder like Zeus! We'll bring the wrath of the gods down upon them! Is he always this positive? Always. That's why I like him. Poseidon, carry us to Athens! First, we need to go to Andros. To Andros, then! We're going to have to do some upgrades to my ship if we're sailing in war! What do you mean? Well, she's old, and perhaps not in the best condition! You couldn't have said this before we set sail? Where in Poseidon's name are we going to get the supplies? My father taught me that the sea takes and... We must do the same. Fortunately, there are plenty of pirate ships in these waters that we can board and take from. What are we waiting for? 
Bay of Marathon. Marathon? You know, the battle where a handful of Athenians push back the first Persian invasion. Mm. The great Themistocles. King Darius of Persia. I'm not sure. A site where the great Messeos slayed the vicious Cretan bull. Oh, that Marathon. We've got a fight coming! Be ready! Archers! Get ready! Turn, Commander. Approaching the island of Angus, Cassandra. 
Yes, here we can see the tomb of the greatest Myrmidon, Achilles. I was more excited by the fact that Andrus explored some of the most expensive parts of the Here it is. door? I've never seen anything like it before. How do I get inside? I wonder if... Hesitation only hastens. The grave, I know, Mater. Your form is improving. Your resolve is strong. But you're not taking action. I was going to. I know. But it's the moments in between that decide everything. Your turn. Leonida's spear. You're old enough now. My father's spear holds a certain burden, but you're ready. Something. Huh? The spear. It has magic. It carries with it a long line of power. A bloodline of incredible heroes. The same blood within you and me and our family. All of us? Think of Leonidas. He had great courage. And he made a great sacrifice. 
you share in his blood and the strength he possessed. We are able to feel certain things happening around us. That is our family's gift. But not everyone understands that. Some recognize the power we bear and want it only for themselves. They will try to take it from us. I won't let them. I know. You're a warrior. If we keep moving forward, always moving forward, we're untouchable. Storm's coming in. Then maybe we should move forward now. <laughs> Mother, I haven't forgotten you. like this exist? How could I even explain this to someone like Marcos? Something's glowing over there. Demos. The Forge. I knew I let you stay in the Animus too long. Your vitals are crashing. You don't understand. This confirms it. Cassandra didn't just have Isu technology. She had the means to improve it. Imagine how powerful the staff could be. I admit, that could be an incredible find. But right now, I'm the doctor, and I take care of you. Now get some rest before you go back to Cassandra. You insist, but only because I've got work to do on the outside. Please, just clear your head. The last thing we need is a cell leader suffering from the bleeding effect and spearing us because we're Hittites or Thracians. I won't, but Thracians throw great parties. Don't forget, we're a team. We'll back you up until you're finished your investigation. I know. Kyoshi secured the loft yesterday and he's keeping an eye out. Alana's on call doing historical research. And I'm here to talk if you're feeling any confusion from the Animus. Always the therapist. So, Doctor, how do you feel now that we're closer than ever to the staff? I believe this staff is important. But the Templars and Assassins have found staves of Eden before. Nikolai Tesla blew one up in Russia, if I remember correctly. This is different. If what I saw in Egypt is true, this staff doesn't control minds. It controls physics. Time. Imagine rewriting the rules of the universe. The spear you found is right here, and it's not doing anything. The spear's attached to a bloodline. Leonidas, Cassandra, and Themos, I mean, Alexios. They were intimately connected to it. Are you sure you can use the Staff of Hermes, then? No. But if the Templars get it, they won't stop until they find someone who can. 
So, what do you think of my new Animus? You mean our new Animus? That's Abstergo equipment. Which I've modified to within a millimeter of its digital life. It's an Animus console prototype, Brahman variant, with the IO capacities pushed to their max. Ultra portable with more calculating power than NASA and CERN combined. So, Doctor? I believe this staff is important. This is different. If what I saw- The spear you- The spear is a- Are you sure? No. I'll go stretch my legs. Too bad we don't have access to the Abstergo gym anymore, huh? Membership costs too much. Fascinating. Layla, can you believe we're meeting Herodotos himself? I can. He sure does talk a lot. Is there anything I can help you with? So does what I'm seeing as Cassandra match your research? I had to tweak the Animus to use what we have of the book as reference. That book is a lost work by Herodotos. He basically invented the concept of recording history. And other figures are matching up too. Cleon, Pericles... The chance to see the past firsthand is why I joined the Assassins. Most people would talk about justice or leaping across rooftops, but history's cool too. I've loved history since my grandpa told me stories about his grandpa back in Ireland. He was an adventurer and sailor, so I'm continuing the family tradition. I feel so lucky. You make your own luck, remember? Why do people keep telling me that? So I've met Irodotos, but I don't know much about him. He's brilliant. His histories are considered the foremost textbook of classical Greece. People have made their careers analyzing his words for some new perspective. To see him in his own world, walking in the polis, and... Sorry, but he's kind of a hero of mine. You can fangirl all you want. Yay! I'll leave you to your work. If you need anything, just let me know. I should check my email. Eagles are fine and all, but a pet monkey would be even cooler. Third echelon. Or was it fourth? Too bad we had to leave before we could drink some more caribou. How's it going out there? Well, no threats in view. I'm glad we could work together again. I believe our working methods are compatible. Are you still upset about our last run-in with Abstergo? I'm sorry, I didn't realize those hills in Quebec were so steep. But hey, you and your Yakuza reflex have saved us. Sorry, ex-Yakuza. We're all alive and our injuries have healed. That's what matters. Of course, I'll return to the Animus, then follow the trail Irodotos left to find the staff. But there's so many possibilities, so many choices. There's no way to know which ones are right. You used to run part of the Japanese Brotherhood. What would you do? Take things one step at a time, observe their act, or kill everyone and search their pockets for answers. You decide. Thanks for watching our backs, Kiyoshi. I'll leave you to your work. I'll report in if Abstago drops by.
Are you sure you want to go back into the Animus right now? I get the impression you'll be there a long time. Yes. I'm ready to go back to Cassandra. All right. I'll be watching your back. Spear is stronger now. The cult won't stand a chance. Well, Herodotus will be happy. It's clear someone was here far before we were. Did Leonidas know this place existed? You're not hard to track. Did you come alone? Are you all right? <laughs> Alexios, you're alive. Don't touch me. <laughs> come on, little brother. You have to tell me everything. What's happened to you? I don't have to tell you anything. I don't know you. Well, I know you. It doesn't matter. There's more important things to argue about. You're right. Like that stunt you pulled with the artifact. It got my attention, if that's what you wanted. What? The artifact showed the truth. We're family. And we made it out of Sparta alive. <laughs> yes, it did show the truth. It confirmed what I always knew. You threw me off a fucking mountain! If that's what you think, Alexios, you must have hit your head on the way down. I've heard this story. And not from a liar like you. And never call me Alexios. Right. Demos. Now him, I don't know. He's a demigod. Worshipped and feared by the cult and all the Greek world. Huh. 
Then why do the cult's bidding? Have you been paying attention? They're following my lead. Then make a choice on your own. Help find our mother. <sighs> I'm not interested in reunion. I just want to know what you think you're doing. Same thing as your cult. Looking for Mirini, our mother. They don't need her. Your cultists think differently. She's their next target. If they ever pursued her, it would be to kill her. But if you don't know where she is, that means she abandoned you too. How sad. Even if we were abandoned, we survived. We can go back to the way things were if we can find her. The cult has no interest in sentimentality or family. Its only aim is control. After all of us, there's one less person to find. I killed Nikolaus. Yet here you are, acting so righteous, when really, you're just like me. I don't care what you think. I'll find Mirini. Do the right thing. Come with me. What? We could find her. Together. You could help me. <laughs> oh, you think friendship is the answer? Running around like lost children looking for dear mother. You're so weak. Weak? I've had to kill for much longer than you've had to. Oh, I'm so scared. I have an army behind me. One false move and you're obliterated. That's the plan. Taking your own mother isn't enough for them? We're not abductors. We're political. Those who don't stand with us, stand against us. And they pay for that mistake. Like me. Like you. I heard you're planning a trip to Athens. When you go, tell Pericles and his elitist scum they're next. The cult let Mirini live. They let Nikolaos live. Why kill them now? Because you live. You brought this on her and yourself. The cult is powerful, but they're mortals. I have the blood of gods, so they think you do too. But they'll see how wrong they are. The cult let Mirini live. Because you live. But... I'm going after the cult, you know. You've seen our numbers. You've seen what I can do. And you still think you stand a chance? Try me. So having guts runs in the family, does it? <laughs> you claim we have the same blood. So let's see what you can do. I'll take the challenge. <sighs> Malaka. Herodotus won't believe this. I have to tell him what happened. Was the legend true? Was it magnificent? What happened to you? And your spear? Slow down, Irodotos. My spear's stronger now. I can feel it. You were right. There was some kind of artifact there. It showed me a vision. Of me and my mother. So... The ancient civilization is real. Cassandra, you have no idea the power you possess. All harnessed in Leonidas' spear. That's not everything. Demos followed me here. The cult's already moving, he told me himself. 
They're going after us. My family, Pericles. Why would he tell you? Unless it was a trap. It doesn't matter. We have to get to Athens to warn Pericles. And we need to find my mother before they do. Then, we go to the Pnyx. If Pericles is anywhere, he's there. Slaves understand you better when you carve your rules into the backs of their heads. <laughs> What's one life worth without a thousand others behind it? Who needs democracy when Thrakmi rules the world? I spent 20 years at sea, only to realize the cult was my home. I will follow the most to the underworld, and bring my hordes with us! The fight is only over when I am the last man left standing. Chaos is our greatest strength! The cult is nothing without me. Even the gods cower in my wake. Kneel or die.
to set sail! Commander! Back! Treacherous around chaos. We should be careful. What? Charybdis and Skila awake at the bottom of the sea, I suppose. No! Pirates! A lot of them! <laughs> Only pirates? Wars down! <laughs> When you're ready, meet me at the Pnyx in Athens. Let's see what this city has in store for me.
famous Acropolis. A testament to humankind's skill and craftsmanship. Here we are. I might have a job for you, if you're as good a fighter as I've heard. You've heard of me? Don't let it go to your head. I hear about everything that happens in this city, Mistyos. With flattery like that, how could I possibly turn you down? I'm not trying to flatter you. I'm trying to hire you. I need some Spartan military targets removed. I think you may have the wrong idea about me, General... Demos Thenis. I'm not a murderer. If that's what you expected. I expected you were someone who wants to get paid. Was I wrong? No, not completely. Fine, what do you want? My spies tell me the Spartans are mobilizing. What I want you to do is hamstring them. Get into their forts and remove the commanders in charge. I guess that makes sense. I'm thrilled you approve. You'll need to bring me the sailors of the commanders you kill as proof. You'll be amply rewarded. Those don't seem like standard Athenian tactics. They're not. But it will work, and that's what matters. We've already lost too many Athenians to those savages using traditional warfare. The other generals disagree, but I refuse to let them destroy our chances. What do they want to do? They want honorable face-to-face -face warfare, pitting our forces directly against the Spartans. We're not going to win a contest of strength against those brutes. We need to outthink them. So, will you kill the commanders? All right, I'll take the job. Good. I might not have approval to deploy our men to do this, but I'm not about to let that stop me. What's so special about these seals? Only elite Spartan commanders carry these seals, those in charge of entire forts. They'd all die before parting with them. So bring me the seals as proof that they're dead. Where can I find them? The Spartans have been making inroads into Athenian territory, taking over forts that once belonged to us. Make them pay for every inch. What's your strategy? Whatever it takes to protect Athenian lives and kill Spartans. That's not what I meant. What's your personal strategy? My career is none of your business. Know that I don't seek much. Only proper recognition of my strategic brilliance. You told me enough. I'll get your seals for you, General.
draw near to our walls, but we must come together now for the glory of Athens. Glory for you! <laughs> friends, friends, please! Just because the Spartans are near our walls does not mean we can act like them. A good crop. Shame the Spartans burned the fields where it grew. The Parthenon is glorious, Pericles, but at what cost? How many tree dams could we have built instead? We must not become divided! We are divided! And the Spartans are winning! Act, Pericles, or I will! Oh, good. You came. Things are worse than I feared. Cleon has turned the mob. We have to hurry. Where? To Pericles. Stay back! She is no threat to Pericles, I assure you. Ah, Herodotus. It's fine. Let them through. It's good to see you again, Pericles. And you as well. I only wish it were under better circumstances. And who's this? Cassandra. Welcome, Cassandra. And what did you think of your first taste of Athens? I think you and Cleon both made good points. Good points aren't at all what the crowd seem to care about. They're afraid, and Cleon indulged their fear. Pericles, we've come to... We must choose our moment wisely, and speak our words more privately. Fine. We've come to you on urgent business. As does everybody. I may have told Cassandra you'd invite her to your symposium. You'd ask me to exclude every Athenian and invite an outsider instead. You heard the crowd. They don't need another reason to hate me. If she's working for you, maybe the prying eyes will see her as a servant. I'm no one's servant. Cassandra, this is Athens. If you want something, sometimes you have to play a role. And what exactly is it that you want? We're all after something, even you. Hmm. You're better at reading others than you let on. Just tell me what to do. First, check on my colleague, Medijos. He was meant to meet me today, and it's not like him to miss an appointment. Done. My friend, Phidias, needs to be taken out of Athens as soon as possible. Anything else? Yes. There is an ostracism vote taking place that could use your uh, influence. Meteochos, you said he was your colleague? A politician and ally. He's one of my most loyal friends. Pythias, the famous sculptor? What did he do exactly? He stands accused of multiple offenses and is awaiting trial. You'll find him under close guard at his workshop. Ostracism. Exile is a term you may be more familiar with. Here in Athens, we vote between two people to decide who should leave. It's between the sophist, Anaxagoras, and another man on trial for impiety. My contact near the Agora will give you the details. I'll do it. I'll expect you to use discretion. That went well. It isn't exactly an invitation, but the promise of one is just as good. Although I'm sure he'll still ask Aspasia if it's okay. So long as it comes. Ah. <laughs> 
Sheriff Ren, I saw you talking to my associate, Pericles. From what I saw, you weren't doing much associating. That's just politics. Pericles is a good man, a fine man, just not the right man. That's not what I heard. From whose lips? His? He was elected. Athens is the seat of democracy. Oh, it is. It's just that the wrong man is sitting in that seat. Did you actually need something, or did you just want to educate me on the finer points of democracy? Pericles is holding parties for the rich and powerful Why we're under siege. What I want is for my people to reclaim control. You could help me. And how do you want me to help? Help Athens, not me. The Spartans howl outside our city walls. Create chaos among their ranks. Make them suffer as we do. Think about it. Will you take my commission and show the Spartans we are not defeated yet? I have no problem killing Spartans. Good. Kill their commander, Nabis. Destroy their supplies and return to me with proof of your exploits. Show them that we have teeth, too. I'll get it done. Trust me, this is a huge opportunity for you. Cosmos demands to know the secrets hiding in the hearts of men, so I simply cut them open. Thank <laughs> you. 